So this is Yvonne Brooke filling in for Mike Opelka today. Uh, I'll be doing this through Thursday. And, uh, you know, to understand what America is, I think it's valuable to understand where it came from. What was the founding of America really about? Which is just a bunch of, as some people would like to describe it, a bunch of white guys who are fed up with a king. What was the ideas that made America possible? America is an ideological revolution. America, at its founding, is the implementation of an idea in politics, in reality. It's not just, you know, defining a new country. America was a different country than any other country that had existed before. America is the first country in human history founded on a moral principle. That principle is individual rights. The idea that every one of us as an individual has a right, therefore is free, to pursue our own life, to live our lives as we see fit in pursuit of the rational values necessary to live. And rational is important. America is the country that comes at the pinnacle of the age of reason. It's not an accident. Reason. The founders admired reason. They understood that reason was our means for knowing the world. That reason was our means of gaining knowledge. And that if human beings were going to survive and thrive, they needed to be free to use their reason in order to achieve their values. But to the founders, reason was at the core of what it meant to be human. This country is the country of the Enlightenment, of the age of reason, of the idea of science, discovery, knowledge, reality, the idea that we can know the world, that we can discover truth. And therefore, as individuals, as we discover truth as individuals, we must be free to express that truth. We must be left alone to apply that truth, to build businesses, to create stuff. And once you create it, it's yours because you created it. It's not the states. It's not the groups. It's not the collectives. It's not societies. It's not the kings. It's not the tribes. It's yours. Starting with your life and the things that you produce, they are yours. Nobody else has a claim against them. That is the genius of America. The idea of individual rights. The idea that individuals must use their reason freely to pursue the things necessary for them to live. So when you start a business and create something new, that is yours. And the only way to live is by producing, creating, building. So America is the idea of individualism combined with the idea that reason is our means of survival. Our basic means of survival is reason, to think, to identify truth and reality, to identify the facts of reality, to integrate them into new knowledge, and to apply that knowledge to our lives as individuals. America was the rejection of collectivism in all its different forms, all its different forms, from monarchy to tribalism to even to absolute democracy, where the majority gets to decide everything. That's why the founders established a constitutional Two republic minutes. to protect the smallest of all minorities, to protect the individual. So that is what America is. Those are the ideas that made it great.